What's the definition for uh, M under bisected by uh, C. So we can do, we can look at angle 5 and angle 6. We already know that these are complementary for statement B. And angle 5 and angle 1 are vertical angles, which are equal. So this equals this. And if this and this are complementary, that means that this and this would be complementary. So then I rewrote the equation. I put an equals negative 2.5. I put four in front of the C's and move that. So it's basically the same thing. And then I put that in my calculator and I got negative 2.5, negative 10, negative 40, negative 160, and negative 600. Beautiful, red flag. Thank you. Good. Do you guys know what side is the left side of negative one? Yes, good. Okay. Uh, what about the front? Do you guys know what side is left side of negative one? Okay, perfect. When you explain your answer to us, I want complete. Complete steps with all correct answers, guys. So all you have to write is angle D and angle F are congruent. No. If they're complementary or supplementary to the same angle, then they're congruent. Oh. Alright, so our equation is A N equal three to the power of N D minus one. A1 will equal 3R minus 1, which will go to 1. Then A2 equals 3 to the power of 2 minus 1 equals 3. Then A3 equals 3 to the power of 3 minus 1. So after the yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. 